Algebra 2, this is Chapter 6, Section 2. This is Example 2 of 5. And in this case, we're going to graph a quadratic equation. Um, this one is not quite in the right form. It needs to be in standard form. So we need to rearrange it. Um, so this should be an x squared minus 4x. Uh, move the 4 to the other side so you would add 4 to both sides and set it equal to 0. So that would be in standard form now that we can work with it. Okay, we need to plot points because again that is all you know at this point is how to plot points. So we're going to graph this and figure out what the solutions are. Um, so let's get started. Let's put in a 0 because that's always a great starting point. Wow, that just jumped all over the place. So if I put in a 0 up here, let's move this up and grab a pen. So that would be 0 squared minus 0 plus 4, so that's going to be a 4. And then we can try 1 and see what 1 looks like. So this is going to be 1 squared minus 4 plus 4. And so 1 minus 4 plus 4 would be 1. Now I'm going to try 2 and see what that gets. So 2 squared is 4 and 2 times 4 is 8. And we've got a 4, so that is going to be 0. And we're going down and our numbers are getting closer together. So I'm going to keep going that direction and see what happens here. Um, so let's try a 3. So 3 squared is 9 and 4 times 3 is 12 and plus 4. So this is going to be 13 minus 12, which is 1. And I have my duplicate right here on my y, so I know I have found my peak on my parabola. I'll go one more, though. Um, so let's go 4. So that would be 16 minus 16 plus 4. Right, 4 squared is 16. 4 times 4 is 16. So it's 16 minus 16 plus 4. And again, you see 0 is going to be the max or min. Um, since A is positive, we know that we have a min. And then we can plot the point. So I've got the point 0, 4. Oops, 1, 2, 3, 4. That's going to be up here somewhere. And then I've got the point 1, 1. And I've got the point 2, 0. Definitely have the wrong kind of graph on this one. I've got the point 3, 1. Hold on, I'm just going to switch graphs real quick. There, I like this graph better. OK, so that, let's try that again. So 0, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 1, 2, 0, 3, 1, and 4, 4. And then I can sketch in my parabola coming down, find my min, and back up. Oops. Erase that edge off of there a little bit. There we go. So there's my parabola. And know that parabolas do go on or quadratics go on forever. So I can put arrows on the end of that. And then we want to know what our solution is. Our solution is where we cross the x-axis or where we touch the x-axis. And we touch it in one place. We have one solution to this. And the solution is the point 2, 0. So that is our solution. Sometimes we just call that 2.